come. Here's Willie. Short outside the off stump. Club down the ground for. Stokes can't get across from mid off. That was baseball, not cricket. Smash back past the bowler. Hit really hard. And it might be that Pant will finish this off quickly. Yeah, he didn't even quite get hold of that, to be honest. It kind of plinked at the bottom of the bat, but he's still, because of the way he goes about his business, throwing everything at it, got enough. Well, it's been a wonderful exhibition, and Hardik Panya as well. It's 2.40 for five, 20 to win. Here is Willie Bowling, short, swatted away, four more. Deep back with square leg. Willie testing out the middle of the pitch, and Pant testing out the deep backward square leg boundary. Feverish atmosphere inside this ground now. After this magnificent exhibition from uh, Rishabh Pant, circumspect in that first 50, but he's broken free. He was missed by Jop Josh Butler on 18, stumping chance. Big moment in the game. It felt it at the time, actually. England putting a man out at deep mid-wicket. 16 to win. Willie goes in and bowls to Pant. It's full. It's drilled for four more. Wide of Ben Stokes in mid-off. Pant's in a hurry. And India closing in on victory. Three thrilling strokes in a row from Rishabh Pant. I would have liked to see Rich Topley come back. A couple of overs to go, to be honest. It, when there were about 40 runs needed, you felt that England just needed something X Factor, something to break through. You go to a, your informed player who's had a number of player of the matches. They've just missed a trick. Feels like David Will is a bowling machine at the moment. He's going in and bowling, supplying Rishabh Pat, who flicks that away down towards fine leg. That'll be another one. Four falls in a row. Short from Willie, helped on his way by Rishabh Pant. And India are nearly there. We need eight more to win that bridge. Brings up the 250. 252 for five. That was more finesse from Pant. It was helped on its way, really. Not much power in that shot. Didn't get all of it. But England are a beaten side. Eight to win. Bags of overs left, and wickets in hand. Willie Bowles, Pant drills that down the ground, out towards the long run boundary, that's another four. Wonderful batting from Rishabh Pant. And Willie walks back, and he looks defeated. He's come up against Rishabh Pant, past 100, and prepared to really take it on. Magnificent batting, exhibition batting, delighting this Big crowd at Old Trafford and the huge India support that are here. Since reaching 50, he's got another 70 or 40 balls. So that's five fours in a row. A sixth four in a row will complete victory. And there's one ball left in the over. Well, we've seen some overs disappear this summer. This is another one of them. We saw 35 off an over. Incredible over off Stuart Broad. Bumrah batting and Rishabh Pant is producing something special here five fours in the over a long conversation going on at mid-off <laughs> I don't know what it's about it's just breaking down the momentum I guess just could be yeah. Yeah. yeah I don't think they're having a any like you know serious chat or something yes there'll be a few field change changes here but what we're witnessing is something extremely special here yeah, Rishabh Pant in that kind of form and what an innings this has been, how well he's beasted. It's Ben Stokes talking to David Willey, saying a long time to bowl what might be the final ball of the match. India need four to win and to win the series. Pants 120 not out. Willie bowls. Oh, and he, he does exactly what Jasprit Bumrah did off the final ball of that Stuart Broad over. He sort of blocked it and got a single into the onside. A bit of an anti-climax at the end of the over. That was wonderful batting. 21 runs off the over. India need three to win. They have eight overs in which to get them. They have five wickets left. And Hardik Pandya and Rishabh Pant have guided India to a series victory here, just about. Just need to finish it off now. Pandya making 71 from 
55 balls. He was out, caught by Stokes. Uh, Rishabh Pant has just taken over. And it's three runs to win. Yeah, I mean, it seems it's going to be Joe Root to bowl this over. Can he finish it off in style? Well, he's a huge follower of MS Dhoni. He's a huge fan and MS Dhoni is kind of his mentor. And usually MSD would finish off games with a big hit. Is Rishabh thinking on those lines here? Well, it's nearly done. The butler fiddling with his field. But all those England players out there know they are beaten. Rishabh Pant's 121 not out of 112 balls. Here's Root going into bowl to him. Reverse sweep for victory for India. Magnificent way to finish the match as well. And Pant stands there and points to the dressing room. He's finished 125 not out. And India ultimately have crushed England here by five wickets with so many overs to spare, thanks to a magnificent innings from Rishabh Pant. The best of Pant today. We saw some of it, a lot of it, in that test match at Edgbaston. That wasn't worth an Indian victory, but it's certainly been worth it today. Pant has given India the win and they won the series as well. Magnificent effort from him. The, the England players uh, patting him on the back, shaking hands with him as well. They know they've come up against an extremely skillful and worthy opponent today. Uh, Jimmy Anderson said it earlier, what's he like to bowl against? He's a nightmare. And it was like that for England today. Yeah, but obviously, I mean, the f when he came out to bat, 74 for four, actually, had, in fact, that partnership between him and Hardik started at 74 for four. India in trouble at that point in time. Obviously, England were ahead and how these two, Hardik and Rishabh, kind of reined themselves, reined in themselves and then, you know, took their time, built that partnership up and then fi finished it in style. Unfortunately, Hardik, Hardik departed a, a while back, but Rishabh was there till the end to finish it off with 125 not out. And some of those shots he played in the last few overs were unbelievable. I mean, that slog sweep, to David Billy, that was an unbelievable...